Vete. Vete. really quiet this morning and a bit disappointing and um, so I decided to throw a little cob bait really short um, first throw it was basically I don't know three minutes in the water and um, onto a fisher um, not shaking as much as I I'd want for a cob but uh, it's a sun tie Here's the sun tie. Here's the sun tie. This is an absolute tank of a laser. No, I haven't seen one this big for no, a while. No, I'm talking this species was a cob, but it turned out to be a massive lesser. Look at that big shovel head of it. Big thing. Um, 
maybe be really lucky. Um, we're going to look at pressure shock because the water is a bit colder today. We can do it. But yeah, it's really disappointing because it's really good conditions that we're fishing in. And it's absolutely dead quiet, but no, that's for sure. And um, yeah, let's make a move for it. There's a lot of colors I don't know where to go See a lot of colors Only feeling blue There's a lot of colors yeah, the walk is a breeze <laughs> Don't rely on others To get you through the maze Ja, ik ben er klaar. Ik ben er klaar. Ik ben er klaar. Ik ben Ja. Toen was ik ook ach. Ik ben ook was. Oh, nee, 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 maar niet. Woe. Ga naar rechts met die. Ja. <laughs> Wat denk jij is dit? Een uh, klein bronze. Een klein bronze. <laughs> ja, ik vind het toch. Moet je gaan gewoon een keer rechts? Gaan naar rechts. Rechts, rechts, rechts is daar kijk. Hij gaat naar die klippen toe, Betty. Hij wil net nog een trekje. Okay, try it on. Nikki stands there, he's going to in the pot. You try it, you can. try it. Oh, yes, sir. Come langs, come langs, come langs. Nog langs, nog langs. Betty. Ga langs. Kan je af? Kan je hier af? Nee, ja, kom dus niet. Kom achter die. Kom achter die. Ik ga achter die. Stand voor in de mieke. Voor. Kijk, kijk of je hem dier als je op je kan trekken, Betty. 
Det var også lejen. Det er ikke. Så andre er det. Du må. Det andre er fisk over de rocks. Og vi har ikke tid til å lage nye tackle, så vi må gå og fiske. Så det er alltid svært på høy tid, ja. Spesielt for de unge ones. Okay, over the nut. Another little hammer. Wait, I'm going to end the track, let me go off the track here soon too. Ja, hou hem net hoor. Mooi beta. Kijk eens, zit je dan? Kop eerste. Kop eerste. Waar zijn we? Waar gaan we? Waar zijn we? Mooi beta. Geef vijf. Small hammers in the water. But, um, it's fun at least for Zandra keeping him busy, letting him catch a couple of fish during the holidays. He just loves catching something. Kijk voor Miki. Voor van. Voor voor een kunnen achter dit.
hold it in quick before it goes around that rock. Hold it, hold it, hold it, come on. I still want this. Ready? to come with toes in so that I can show it to you guys and um, there you can see it's relaxed now and um, yeah there we go uh, much better size one but um yeah better we get him back a day what that was supposed to be a duck ball mission and just a fishing outing it turned into be like just me spending time with the kids Dirkie um, thought no nah, it was too late so he left um, to go back home and just chill at home um, but I'm on holiday and um, I can't sit at home so I thought well have a little bit of footage let's see if we can't make you just a video out of it it doesn't matter how big the fish are but it's it's just to get Zandre next to the ocean, get him to fish. And he's in training process, if I can say that. Because um, I like to just take him and just teach him the ways of the ocean and then let him learn and get the feel of what baits to put on and how to put the baits on. At this stage, he's putting the baits on himself. I tell him what to put on and then he just, yeah, he just holds the bait and he executes it beautifully <laughs> and then I throw for him because um, yeah, we, need to, we need a little bit more distance here to throw but as you guys can see he fights the fish himself lands himself, hooks him himself and um, yeah, he just loves it uh, yeah, my daughter is playing around here she's doing handstands there in the grass and then she's here in the tidal pool yeah, she, she just loves the nature as well and yeah, wife is back home taking the power nap she enjoys that and um, yeah she said she's gonna join us a bit later so she might walk up here and I'm sure she'll bring a, a beer or a savannah or something as well but you know I'm gonna make a couple of more throws and hopefully I hook into a duck well Mooi, good day so my stock is achter you eh? can go rechts but you can rechts for now I don't know that I can go rechts there so guys, so this is all about the coaching and whew, look at that. Looks like a better size hammer. But you can do It's all about the coaching. So for you guys that don't understand Afrikaans, go gaan rechts means go right. And um, yeah, it's just a coaching process of him landing a fish and planning where his line is going and then planning ahead of what to do and where to go and how to land the fish so but as you guys can see look at that stance the fishing is not in his blood i don't know look now better in with you okay track you may now down to go on that pinky and on that pinky look where your line is no Daar die haai om my klip swim, laat jy my in die klip vast trek hier, hoor jy. Hou jy line op. So I'm just telling him to keep his line up. And then to time it, because there's a rock there. And he needs to pull it either through that gully or through that gully. So he needs to time it to not, and not to pull it into that rock.
Kijk, mooi Boeta, mooi. Trek hem hard, trek hem hard. And I'm seeing that it's arcing to the right. So I told him to pull it hard, so that it will go just on the inside of that rock, and then it will turn around. Hou hem net, hou hem net. So now it's a fish swim right up against that rock, and then you shouldn't pull, you just hold the fish, and let it swim left. And as it starts to swim left, you pull it, pull it again. Okay, so Andres, you track him. Track him with the track him. Track him hard. Track him hard. Track him hard. So now he needs to pull it hard, because it's in the gully. Track him hard. But as I'm waiting for the hammerhead to, to calm down, it's, I just want to explain to you guys, it's, it's, it might be a small hammer, but to him it's excellent practice just to maneuver his way around the rocks. And it's all about timing, when to pull the fish and when not to pull the fish. And, um, and that's currently what he's learning, is fishing on the rocks, when to pull the fish and when not to pull the fish. And that's really important and makes the difference between landing a fish or, or losing a fish. So, yeah, I think he's doing a, a great job. And, um, yeah, it's just a small hammerhead. But, yeah, okay. Okay, I'm going to go. Come on, Kiki, Kiki. Hi, this Ik kan zitten hier is toch? Hij just threw a duck pole bite. Oh, wat ze af? Nee. Oh no guys, jeez, how can that be, how can that be, out of the hook, no man, I was, <laughs> how does that happen, just one of those just, it just happens, um, we got splashed wet with the water so I moved the camera and um, as I picked the camera up I just felt my rod going down, absolutely just flattened me and took a lot of line and um, I just hit click on the record um, just click the record button and just held it on the spool because um, you know, I thought okay, the fish is on and um, 
You know, just as I wanted to put the camera down, I handed it to Zandra or whatever, I can't even remember. I just felt it took to pull. But it was a good fish, it took a good, good amount of line. I'm not completely sure if it was a duck pole, right? It might be, I don't know if it was a better size grey shark or bronzy or what it was. But it was quite a decent sized fish, quite heavy. And um, it's pulling line quite fast. But it doesn't help much crying about spilled milk, but um, yeah. It would have been a lucky fish in the day off. Quickly build a new bait and um, threw it out again now because we're running out of light. And uh, you know, we need to finish up. If you look something too big, <laughs> it's going to be a, a battle in the dark to land this fish on the rocks. But then, um, yeah, we'll give it our best. Damn it. What the hell? On the surface, shaking aggressive. What the hell? No, no, no. It's the grey swimming in all sorts of things. Not the best substitute for the fish that I lost, but um, yeah, end, ending the day off with the little grey shark. You can see the, the ridge on its back there. Um, it's a ridge running there. That's why it's called a ridge. That's why it's called a ridgeback grey shark. Um, just still a juvenile, probably about like six kilos, five six kilos. But um, yeah, unfortunately I lost that other fish, and um, I'm pretty sure it might have been. A bigger grey shark, probably like a 40-50 kilo grey shark. But yeah, that one is, is gone now. And um, you know, that was a pity. We would have loved to end the day off with a better sized fish. Not a small fish, but at least I'm ending the day off with a fish. And not with nothing. Okay guys, we're running out of light, so it's time to go. Zandra had a lekker session this afternoon still hiding there behind his Zuluk buff and I'm um, yeah while I'm pulling his Zuluk buff away it reminds me you guys need to check out my merchandise like you guys can see I'm wearing it today and um, so told you guys this morning as well so um, if you're keen to buy some merchandise send me an email on zulukfishing at gmail.com and I will send the catalog to you guys as well as the order sheet and tell you how to and respond with the um, sales process and then we can go forth and then guys if there's anything that you guys suggest that we should do in the merch line um, please add that in the comment section or send me a mail pop me an email and you know, just some ideas because I, I really want to build a brand and I really want to build a channel so yeah and I can't do that without the help of you guys but um, yeah that's why I'm going with this I can't build this brand and can't build this channel without you so I need you guys to please subscribe to the channel Hit the like button, put on the notification bell so you'll be notified once I upload a video, new video. And um, always keep fishing. Catch you guys in the next one.